Hi guys, how you doing? My name is Crystal. Welcome to my YouTube channel and a change in the weather again. It's raining. Hence the hat and the raincoat. It's raining. Raining in July. And I don't want what happened to me a few weeks ago and that was to get covered in rain head to foot when I had shorts and a t-shirt on so let me grab my water bottle of water and let's go and take Max for a walk Alexa what's the time please the time is 2.04 p.m. I'm not playing games, it's me going out. My mum doesn't walk a dog, she hasn't got one. It's raining quite badly. It's still spitting with rain. Someone's pushing a pram with next on it. <laughs> That's a good start, isn't it? Pushing a pram with next on it. <laughs> to write about that in my diary didn't I? Oh God, how many God years ago was that? Seven or eight? <laughs> yeah I've got my glasses on so I can see the writing. changed into this while I was in my flat about five minutes ago. So a guy got out of his car with a cap on, bloke, and an English bag. Football look. Oh yeah, this is the car that reverses out. This, this is a white car that reverses out. The Chinaman's got in there. <laughs> It got a bit <laughs> it just reverses out, you say. It reminds me of a funny film, Open Reach Torva, T O R V A. Open Reach. There's a guy with beanie hat limping. Got a bad leg. It's always smiling, this guy. This is they're digging a hole. I don't know what they're doing.
digging some sort of hole down there. Someone on the field with a doll, bless, let them come off. And this lorry. Omega, the Greek. Alpha, the beginning of the Greek alphabet. And Omega is the last letter of the Greek alphabet. Sean said he was at um, Greek in him. Greek. <laughs> I just felt tired this afternoon. Tired. I came over like I was going to fall asleep. So I don't want to fall asleep. But I feel like I'm going to get. Allergy so often. Allergies can make you tired. If you're allergic to something, let's wait for these guys to get off the field. Let's come up here for a second. Look at the snails down here. Look. Back look. Invasion of the snails. Them snails. Loads of them. Guys limping back to Costas. <laughs> Coming into the station. Don't like treading on snails. So yeah. I just got ready to come out. I just got ready to come out and I was, I had my hair down, I had my hair down and it took me about five minutes to put my hair up, put my coat on and this cap on. So now let's see this go. Feeling really better now. I've come out that flat. Fucking hell! So I was going to go to sleep. I feel better. Yeah, allergies, hay fever can make you feel sleepy. I've been cutting the grass at the back of the flat. <laughs> Spitting with rain. Brings out the snails. Look at this worm. It'll flow there. They get trodden on now. They're walking all over the path and they're going to get trodden on. And I can't pick them all up. I, I would, you know, I'd pick them all up and put them on the grass because they're going to get trodden on. Should wake me up, getting rains on. So I'm not in my mum's today. Not today. It's coming down a bit worse now. 
to know the way I was feeling before I left the flat. I didn't think I was going to be able to get down the stairs. No, I felt fucking giddy. <laughs> um, Max is a small dog, right? And if you've got pet allergies, I mean, he's tiny, probably, you know, but they've got all sorts of dogs in the flats. So if you're allergic to dog hair, you're fucked unless you take allergy tablets. That's why you shouldn't really take dogs into a shop as well, because people are allergic to, to pets. As well as it being unhygienic. This one's moving. Slowly. They're just snails. They don't. They don't realise that they're walking across a path. That's horrible. I don't like it. <laughs> the sound of a snail being crunched. the riverside walk we can oh no there's somebody coming with a baseball cap on let's go down this way get more exercise Have my lunch. Corned beef and mashed potato. Banana for breakfast. Uh huh. Go in the grass, it's wet. <laughs> Try to keep up, right? I do feel a bit dizzy. remember I've got nerve damage to my face I've got nerve damage I've taken five or six phone calls over the past couple of days I've also got bad tooth I think it's a cause of a lot of the trouble. <laughs> Let him off, I can't see anybody else. Bless this bloke though, he said that if he came down he'd take the dog for a walk with me. That would be nice. <laughs> but, you know, you've got to be careful though, because what people say 
leading up to coming to meet you is different how they act when they actually do so <laughs> I don't trust anybody <laughs> I mean, the guys that came out to my other flat, right, they didn't go for a walk with me. But it's been six, seven years. I will see if it's changed, because I'm a lot older than I was. Castle. It's getting older and older. Bits of it must fall off. I've still got to go up there, you know. Max, Max, I've been to Up North Castle, I said. I haven't actually been inside that castle and I've lived here for four years now. <laughs> Max! If you run off, I can't run after you, mate. I can't! <laughs> Max! He's pretending to be deaf. Max. Max. Wait. 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 Are you a good boy? Yes, you are. Don't drink enough water, that's my problem. So we're overclouded here, over <laughs> overcast and cloudy, overcrowded, and uh, you can't get a good clear picture but I've got my glasses on that I got from Boots and I can see everything clearly <laughs> now he's disappeared Max there he is No, I was woken up about five o'clock this morning by the guy upstairs getting ready for work and I really don't get enough sleep. So I went to bed, it must have been getting on for midnight and then I get woken up at five o'clock and you don't go back to sleep properly. He's been getting up for work or whatever he's doing. I don't know what he's doing, but like for, for months now. Must be a long day. I know when my ex-husband worked nights, I never saw him. Because he, he fell asleep at the weekend. So he'd work nights, be asleep during the day, and then at the weekend he'd, he'd be asleep in bed because he was so tired. <laughs> yeah, when I first got married, my ex-husband worked nights. Not good, but at least he had a job. <laughs> Thank you.
No, it was it was four days a week. He worked nights, and then it had turned around to daytime. We mostly worked nights. Oh, there's somebody else walking around the field now, and I'm not walking across the grass because it's wet. So we're going to walk this way. We'll walk back. We'll walk back. I ain't walking in the grass with fucking trainers and socks. <laughs> no, I'm not. I'm going to stay on the path. Twenty minutes anyway, he's had a walk. It's twenty-five past two. I left at two, so we've been out twenty-five minutes. I ain't bugging him around in the middle of the grass. I hate wet socks. Because the socks get wet, then you get black bloody feet, and then I've got to have a shower. <laughs> That's good, I've got this train, rainbow on the front, bullet train, going into Rochester Station. Right guys, see you later.